Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Inside of today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the best six brawlers that you can hard carry with inside of Brawl Stars. So whether you're playing with randoms or trash teammates like Tom and Drage, these brawlers will be helping you uh, push a lot in Brawl Stars, win a lot of games and whatever else, uh, obviously, if you have to hard it carry. So before we get into that, uh, make sure you're using a credit code in the shop. That would be greatly appreciated. And without further ado, let's jump into today's video. All right, guys, so jumping into number six, we're starting off with Byron. So Byron... I believe is a really big hard carry brawler inside of this meta. Not only is he like a top 10 brawler, so obviously like the best brawlers inside of a meta on Pacific maps are going to be like the hard carry, but I just feel like Byron with the way his mechanics are designed and just overall how good he is and in like certain situations he can be so so strong. I just think that he's one of the hard carry brawlers. You know, you've got your splash ability, you've got so much healing potential that like you could just basically heal up your teammates so easily to win their lane a lot of the times. So obviously if your heals aren't on point then your teammates aren't going to be able to survive as well as he anticipated so unfortunately we're probably going to concede there uh because our teammates kind of spending more time spinning than focusing on the game but yeah uh byron just absolutely insane in this meta for sure and i just feel like with the heals and just overall mechanics even if he isn't good in the meta this type of brawler is just built to like carry like you can just do absolute work uh, with him no matter who you're facing off against you can really put in a lot of damage on the field so we're going to splash this mortis should be able to get him down and we're going to be able to score so again like my teammates are just constantly relying off me healing them and then also you know i've got to be trying to chip the enemies down i'm supposed to be like uh debating like whether i can kill people with my super there's a lot to take into consideration with byron kind of a high skill cap ruler in my opinion and one of the reasons why i could just pull him out on like most maps and should be able to get a decent result so Although I'm talking about hard carrying, uh, but see, it's kind of hard carrying inside of that game. Uh, but, but yeah, Byron, I feel like uh, obviously it's going to be a little bit map dependent, and a lot of his picks will be. Uh, but just overall, you know, if I'm looking to carry people inside a power league or just in random matchmaking, Byron is one of those brawlers I'll always look out to. So that's going to be the sixth uh, biggest hard carry. Let's hop into number five. All right, guys, so jumping into the fifth biggest hard carry inside of Brawl Stars, we have my boy Gene. So even though Gene isn't really that strong inside of the current meta, I feel like just his overall mechanics, again, are just going to be too, too strong. And the fact that you can just easily pull like a gem carrier, you can easily make a game-changing pull with a gene. I feel like the game-changing brawlers, you know, like Tara as well. Uh, she's obviously not in the top, she's not on the top six list, so kind of ruining that a little bit. But yeah, brawlers like Tara as well, same mechanics as gene, just to turn around the ability with these type of brawlers. They're normally kind of hard carry, so uh, you can get out of like really tough situations with these brawlers, and you can just change the game. So. Yeah, Gene always been one of those brawlers, in my opinion. And the main game mode, again, that I said, is gem grabs. So, like, for example, like, the enemy team has all of their gems. You know, you're in a really tough situation. You get a really clutch pull. You're going to be uh, clutching up the game. There's not many other brawlers like that. Uh, to be honest, apologies for the Elgato today, guys. I don't think it's actually the Elgato. I think it might be a problem with my iPad because I've been having this problem for a long time, as you guys probably know. But we're able to score a great goal like that. You can just see the hard carry abilities with it, Gene. So normally I don't play a good Gene on video, but we do a nice play right there. Let's see if more is, he's going to go for the trick shot. I'm actually using the other gadget with Gene as well. I feel like that one actually could be a little bit better, especially on the longer range maps for sure. So I'm going to use my gadget there. More is probably going to take us down. Only the Crow left. Don't think we're going to be able to survive. But so yeah, as I said, even with Gene uh, not being too strong as well, just his overall mechanics and even his star power as well kind of just carry the team because they're getting healed up constantly. Just one of those brawler, which will always be a hard carry. So unfortunately, they've got a gadget there and I don't think I'm going to be able to uh, take that down. Mortis get some early bats and luckily Crow is able to take him down. I don't know what our Mortis is doing. He's really just hanging about for no reason. Probably just needs to take a little bit more aggro. Yeah, he's just going in a little bit too uh, passively there, which is probably going to result in us losing the game. 40 seconds left. Let's see if we can carry our teammates anymore. I'm just going to pull this Brock. Uh, I've got no ammo, but I'm going to eventually get him down. Leon probably is close to Invisi uh, Hill. Yeah, he has got that now. He's probably popped it. I'm going to just stick close uh, to my teammates here. More is really low already. Should be able to get him down. More is going for the trick shot again. Okay, what? Uh, it's like the second video in a row now. I'm just getting these trash Mortis randoms, but oh, oh no, there's no way. What have I just seen on my screen? What have I just seen on my screen? And again, no. He just needs to quit the game. 
He actually just needs to quit the game while I'm a witness and I'm a screen. I'm just going to pull this mortis and just shoot him. I don't even care if I lose at this point in time. So, yeah, I'm just going to cut the video there because I just feel like that was straight embarrassing. We deserve to lose that one. So, that's going to be uh, the fifth biggest hard carry inside of Brew Stars. Let's hop into number four. All right, guys, jumping into the fourth biggest hard carry inside of Brew Stars, we have Piper. So, you guys might be thinking, well, I'm just listing off the brawlers that I like playing the most. But Piper seriously is one of those hard carry brawlers, especially on the long range of maps, not like Backyard Bowl a lot of gem grab maps, a lot of heist maps. Piper is that hard carry brawler. The reason why is that she can just deal so much damage at long range. And if you're consistently hitting those shots, you're going to be winning your teammates' uh, lanes really, really easily. So you can see that Spike is able to walk it in. Uh, but yeah, you see a lot of the best players in the world. They are really good Pipers just because of the kind of mechanical technique you need uh, other than missing the gadget how do i miss that i'm just going to jump away from the boys should be able to get him down as well but yeah you can't really go into like every single brawl map you know like the close range maps obviously with piper so again like these aren't the brawlers that you can just play absolutely everywhere because they would be like the best brawlers in the game these are like the carry brawlers that you know in power league for example you're on like hard rock mine you're on like backyard bowl piper you'd pick that brawler and you'd carry your teammates just because of how strong her mechanics are but that's going to be the fourth biggest hard carry brawler inside of brawl stars let's hop into number three all right guys so hopping into the third biggest hard carry inside of brawl stars uh, or obviously throw brawler we have a mortis so you guys probably don't like to hear this one and you probably see a lot of mortis inside of ladder but i do think in my opinion anyways that mortis is a very hard carry brawler in the sense that again in game modes like gem grab i always kind of refer to that they just make some like epic comeback plays with mortis a lot of times you can get like 1v3 team wipes and there's not many other brawlers inside of a game right now which you have the potential uh, to do that unfortunately my teammates aren't able to save that but i'll just wait till i get my long dash I should be able to get onto this colt and get my bats so i can chain here let's see colt is going to go down don't really want to dash into a shelly here but we should actually maybe bait this out see if we can take it down in time we're just spamming every single button to try and score there but yeah mortis is one of those brawlers again i'll refer to players like ye like mortis uh, like mortis <laughs> like why do you like lane sorry uh they're the two like best mortises in the world or some of them like semantic as well uh, like literally the the plays they can make on mortis just change the game so easily i won't really say again i'll just play mortis absolutely everywhere but in the right hands mortis can absolutely dominate and hold carry your team so even i got star player i didn't really hold carry too much inside of that game but the potential is insane on this brawler so that's going to be the third biggest hard carry let's hop into number two all right guys so jumping into the second biggest hard carry inside of brew stars we have b so you guys might be surprised by this one but i think b uh, right now well just in general is one of those brawlers which has potential to 1v3 again so in my sense it's a really good brawler to 1v uh, to hard carry it with i always kind of go to this brawler especially in rubble uh, you can easily like slow multiple enemies you can get those 3k shots really consistently it's just a really fun brawler to play and in the right hands again you're gonna absolutely dominate with so this list isn't about like who's the best in the meta uh, obviously B probably would rank around like midway even towards the bottom half of the meta currently but her potential in the right hands in ladder as well is just crazy she can just dominate so so easily so she's just hitting those shots so we should be able to oh I've, i didn't even realize this whole time that we have javi on our team <laughs> uh, which is actually funny enough in random matchmaker don't know who javi is he's a pro player he has a bunch of wins he's got a bunch of rank 30. i think he's got every rank 35 inside of a game really good friend of mine so that's actually quite cool uh, to have on my team but yeah uh, b just absolutely insane carrying potential definitely as well like if you've seen b uh drage play b you know i'm a decent b as well but if you've seen drage play b especially like last year when we spent tournaments with us like you have so many pop-off moments literally 1v3 carriers it was absolutely insane this brawler is really really good uh to learn obviously if you learn uh b you're gonna have a good time pushing trophies in the future so uh, we should be able to win this game really I'm kind of just trolling around i kind of rather just uh, get the win here hopefully leon can walk it in at times it's kind of kind of be hard against a ball to walk that one in okay but we're actually gonna take down the bar in there should be able to get the kill on crow unfortunately he had uh the stop power which makes it so you do less damage also, i think we're probably gonna take him down there uh, but yeah nothing really talking about b i think you guys probably know by the potential she has especially if you're facing like a uh, triple tank for example you've really got the hard carry ability unfortunately i haven't got a gadget there uh, so i can't really save us uh this amber just <laughs> looks terrible uh, she must be lagging or something here let's see if we're able to put this one in against the bull as well gonna be pretty hard to score i'm just gonna slow him down amber gonna be one shot there unfortunately i didn't use my slow on her her ass would have been able to take it down but only the crow left this should be a goal right there should be the end of the game 
Uh, hopefully it can. No, somehow we're not managing to score that one. Getting a little bit awkward now. We just want to finish off the game, so ball's going to go down again. Some wacky combos that we're facing on backyard ball, considering I've literally played uh, like no ladder today. So should be able to take down this Amber. Amber pretty much one shot. That's going to be it. So yeah, that's going to be the second biggest hard carry brawler inside of Brawl Stars, in my opinion. Let's hop into number one. All right, guys, so moving on to the biggest hard carry currently inside of Brawl Stars. We have Bell. So Bell right now inside of the meta, of course, is like the best brawler inside of the game. But just her versatility overall is just pretty insane. Uh, that's why she's obviously the, like, the biggest hard carry. I just think Bell in the right hands. She can 1v3 really well. There's also like every single game mode. I feel like you can actually play uh, Bell to a high standard as well. And pretty much every single map as well. So I just feel like, again, you can just pretty much play her against uh, anyone. Let's see if, okay, no, we're not able to score that. Unfortunately, we've got Shelly on our team. I think we've had the Shelly multiple games in a row and lost like really quick. Uh, I've been having uh, bad Wi-Fi issues for some reason as well. So uh, yeah, anyways, but yeah, Bell going to be absolutely insane in this bet. I don't really need to say too much more. I think you guys probably expected Bell to be probably like the biggest hard carry currently inside of Brew Stars. I think uh, Leon just popped his invisibility. Yeah, he did. Uh, unfortunately, again, I don't really see us winning this game considering we're uh, having a Shelly on our team. But maybe if we pop off, uh, enough we should be able to win so uh, Leon gonna be really really weak there I'm gonna try and get my mark onto Bell that means I can two tap her right there which I do another pop off kill from us I think Moist should be able to get the kill onto Leon and that should be a goal that really should be a goal there. and there's no way they're gonna be able to stop us from that one so you just see there Bell just absolutely tapping uh, we're able to hard carry our team to the goal there so should be able to get a mark onto Bell again that does mean again that I'm able to two tap her at any point in time so if I'm able to connect in time, it should be pretty good. So I'm just going to pass this off to the Mortis. Leon is probably lurking somewhere here. Mortis goes for the quick goal. is not able to convert. I need to heal up. Uh, this isn't looking very good whatsoever. I'm just going to hide near my trap. Buys a little bit of time. Don't know if we're going to be able to uh, defend this one in time. Okay, no. We've got Shelly on uh, defense with a super. I think we should be pretty good. Unfortunately, she's not using it. Though. I don't really know why I uh, should be using this. Uh, pretty soon hopefully uh, i don't think we're going to be able to stop this one unless she uses that super come on shelly come on use that super i know you wanna i know you wanna come on save us here you need to save us leon's going to be here i'm just going to use uh my super and that should be gg really 20 seconds with a shelly on defense i think pretty much this should be a certain that we win this game so yeah bell just going to be hard carrying pretty much everyone inside of stars the case shelly does actually go down there so we need to buy a little bit of time for our teammates to come up Leon has his invisibility. Going to take the bell down. And yeah, that should be GG. I'm just going to try and get my super so I can super click, uh, kick this clear. Okay, yeah, there's no way we're going to be able to score that one. So that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. Apologies for the voice again. Didn't get too much sleep, so uh, I'm a little bit sick in the voice. But yeah, that's going to be it for today's video. Let me know what you think of the list and put your list in the comment section below. would like to hear your thoughts on that one. But that's going to be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.